everybody, and welcome to I Fucking Love Whiskey. My name is Andrew Pierce, and I am here, as always, with my co-host, jo Joseph Limbaugh. <laughs> That's me. I'm Joseph Limbaugh. Hello. Great. What do we start? Let's start. Let's go to our first whiskey. This one, uh, again, uh, there are, what, eight distilleries on Isla, soon to be nine, um, or maybe even ten. Ten. There's actually and there's another couple in the planning as well. Mm. So yeah, pe people apparently think there's something good about the yeah. whiskey that they make on Isla. Um, Lagavulin. Everybody's heard of Lagavulin. This is Lagavulin Eight. It's a special centen uh, bicentennial. Is that right? Bicentennial. bicentennial. Yeah. Uh, release uh, 1816 to 2016. So the 200th anniversary. It's an eight-year-old limited edition, um, and it's called exceptionally fine here. 48% alcohol. So we're starting. So fast out of the gates. Eight year exceptionally fine. And in do we want to talk about the eagle content, the yes. peat particles per million on why don't, this one? Why don't you so, if you know? So in this one this is like about thirty-five peat particles per million, which isn't the highest, which you guys will know from Brook Laddie and Optimore they go higher and uh, like a, and La So just to be clear, for peat this one, particles per million is what yes. you're saying, correct? Yes. <laughs> yes. Phenol, because not phenol, I understood phenol, it, but phenol, I just want to make sure. Yes. No, no, phenol, exactly. phenol particles. Per million. Yes. Yeah. So that's interesting because the yeah. smell in the smell box, phenol is different a different smell than peat. Yeah. But you're saying this is so is it phenol particles it's per minute? Phenol particles per million that's wrapping mm -hmm. around phenol. the barley when they're drying it. Huh. And what is well, I asked I think I asked you before, what is what is phenol? Well, phenol, it was smell, and you were about to get the phenol is like the. Yeah, oh, it's organic. Like it's a kind of organic smell, yeah, isn't it? That's coming off, and that's the. No, like it really uses a lot of sherry casks to uh, it's very light sweetness. It's quite light, yeah. This is Sweet. light after eight years. Yeah, I, I mean, I know, I guess I know the smell of phenol, but I don't, like, what is it? Like, is it just a chemical, um, or is it, you know? Yeah. But, it, and it comes from peat. It's, it's well, the chemical ones that released it. It can be from peat, and it can be from, it can be from uh, woods as well. It's just like a, a chemical reaction that's happening, but, but yeah. the most of it, the phenol is the one that they're using. This is like, this is definitely like you're in a woods, but a woods that has water dripping, like from, and there's moss and there's yeah. like mm -hmm. the rocks, you know, there's a brook going through it. Like this is a really, just an organic, deep in the woods, almost you can't see sunlight sort of a place yeah. to me. It's like, mm -hmm. and I mean, if you, if you know Lagavulin, you would recognize this as Lagavulin. It's not, it's not that far removed, but it's a, it's a sweet, young, fresh, Oh, yeah, version of that. There might be, a co I think there's like maybe a cottage nearby with smoke coming out of the chimney, like that. Like, just a bit of that, you just know. Just going down that. Yeah. Oof. Mm. That is not halfway. Like that is like, this is what, this is what we're giving you. Oh yeah, on the tongue. Oh, that is way too, oh, this is, um, oh, what a treat. Oh, oh. <laughs> this is slap your mama. This is like, dude, this is really good. That's a Scottish That's, expression, I'm sure. Yes. Yeah. Once again, this is not, Halfway, this is like, yeah. yeah. So that's, I I think this is what people imagine scotch to be like so it's, when they imagine like, oh, this is what scotch is. Like, I think this is kind of, you know, it's. When you're first given a scotch and somebody hasn't told you more about it. Yeah. yeah. This is like, there's like a dry coke, like, like it's like a smokeless coal. It's like a coke, it's got a dryness mm -hmm. to it. And, uh -huh. and you've got the, then we've we'll got the sea, I mean. Yeah, I mean, you, you yeah, can't avoid like, it. It's just those, perched it's, right there on those rocks. Yeah. This, yeah, this forest is right I'm next to the ocean. Show. I'm getting bacon. There's a little bit. Of, oh, oh, yeah. I can see that. Cer yeah. Certainly some sort of cured meat. The salt yeah, cured, and, yeah. and something. Yeah, it's very salty. Yeah, and the fact that they've done this as the eight-year-old, now they've taken that, so it's really it's robust. It's... Because the sixteen-year-old is usually what we're used to, mm -hmm. and that one there, the, the barrel is having more of an influence on it. This one, it's having less, and uh, you're getting more about the actual. But it's uh, it's great. Oh, it's, yeah. Yeah, I like this a lot. I mean, I'm a big fan of PD scotches, so it's you know, it's, it's, no, it's no surprise. But like, this is. I'm gonna do uh, really just a nice. drop for science because I might do that. Let me let me just let me. Let's see, see what happens with you, but I might I might do it if if uh, you yes, have a good is. response. Yes, don't use your Ardbeg eyedropper for yeah. this lag of ruling. No, that's what. That's some. That's the distillery. It's so different. It's like a mile away. <laughs> oh oh. Well, it's something no, in the nose. Now, it, now I'm getting like a Chinese tea. Is it that Chinese? That Chinese tea. Like, right, I really, I'm gonna, I'm it's gonna like try a, it. It's got. 
It's, it's like a, a meaty flavour, and even though it's not meat, it's a that smell. Oh boy. Oh yeah. That opens it up. Oh. I'd heard stories that um, Johnny Depp used to order a glass of Lagavulin like, at bars and his teetotal, and he does other things, but it was teetotal, and apparently. He would have um, his glass, he would smell it all smell night, it. and that was it. Spend the night, and that was his enjoyment. It doesn't, it doesn't yeah, surprise me. I could totally see I that. Do it. Yeah. I could do that, yeah. yeah I'm, getting, I'm getting more like um, kind of a citrus with the uh, with the water, I think. Yep. Yeah. Like, like maybe a grapefruit or something, something sour. Hmm. It's, on the tongue, it's delicious. Mm. It opened up a bit. And dry smoke. It did. I, I think um, I like the flavor just a bit more without the water, I think. Um, mm -hmm. But it's, you know, it's subjective. It, they're both good. They're both good. There's nothing nothing wrong with adding a little water to this. Yeah. So which time of the day would you have this one? Mm. Um, we're talking about I, I, I two o'clock. I think this is a two o'clock. <laughs> whatever time of day it is right now, I, I don't think yeah. this would be nice at the end of the day. I think it'd be nice, like mm. you know, before bed or like oh, you're nice. you know reading a book you're in front of the fire. fire. Yeah. 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 For me, it's a little too bright for that. It's it's it's. It could be yeah, a little bit earlier than the. Yeah, I think it'd be yeah. earlier because at the end of the night, I want something just like sherry and dark and you know like shh, go to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> Rocky to sleep in this. No, this is, yeah, right. This is a little bit brighter. I it is bright. End of the day. And... But I guess for me, like most it's really of the, no wrong time. Yeah, most of the PD ones for me are like good end of day. You know, this mm -hmm. the, the end of days. Gosh, I don't know. I don't know what that was. Know what that was. What? <laughs> Influenced by my shirt. I don't know. Yeah, you do. You do Scottish accents. <laughs> do I don't really do Scottish. Yeah. I do British. I don't do Scottish. Yeah. Do a, do, a, do a British one then. Well, uh, welcome to uh, Scotch tasting. We have um, our friend Gary McAdam here today. <laughs> well, thank you, Lord. <laughs> yes, <laughs> it's my Lord. <laughs> upper, upper class British. Yes, it is. Mm -hmm. Yes, because lower class British sounds. Um, that's kind of yeah. It's, it's yeah. usually over the top. Like, ah, oh, here we are. You know. Oh, I could do like a pirate. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, <laughs> we're not here for my accents. Me and Gary on the break wall. <laughs> yeah. yeah. All right. There'll be a strong nor'easterner. Uh, what did we say? Yes? No? Good? Bad? Yes. Good. <laughs> yes. Lovely. Okay. All right. Yeah. yeah. It's a, that's a that's good a one. Yeah, that's a keeper. That's a keeper.